Good day to you, Facebook friends. Our gospel today is taken from Luke chapter 11 verses 47 to 54. In verse 52, I quote, Woe to you, scholars of the law! You have taken away the key of knowledge. You yourself did not enter, and you stopped those trying to enter. In today's gospel, Jesus continues to chastise the Pharisees and the scholars of the law. In this passage, he chastises them because they have taken away the key of knowledge and have actively tried to keep others from the knowledge God wants them to have. This is a strong accusation and reveals that the Pharisees and scholars of the law were actively hurting the faith of God's people. As we have seen over the past few days in the scriptures, Jesus rebuked the scholars of the law and the Pharisees severely for this. And his rebuke was not only for their sake, it is also for our sake, para rin sa atin, so that we know not to follow the false prophets such as these and all who are interested only in themselves and their reputation rather than the truth. Sa ating panahon, marami nga pong false prophets who are interested in only becoming famous and making a lot of money. This gospel passage is not only a condemnation of this sin. More importantly, it raises a deep and beautiful concept. It is the concept of the key of knowledge. What is the key of knowledge? The key of knowledge is faith, and faith can come only by listening to the voice of God. The key to knowledge is to let God speak to you and to reveal to you His deepest and most beautiful truths. These truths can only be received and believed through prayer and through direct communication with God. The saints are the best examples of those who have penetrated the deep mysteries of God's life. Through their life of prayer and faith, they came to know God on a profound level. Many of these great saints have left us beautiful writings and a powerful witness of the hidden but revealed mysteries of the inner life of God, like St. Thomas Aquinas, St. Padre Pio, and the saint whose feast day is today, St. Teresa of Avila. Reflect today upon whether or not you have taken the key of knowledge and opened the mysteries of God through your life of prayer and faith. Recommit yourself to seeking God in your daily personal prayer and to seek all that He desires to reveal to you. Let us pray. Lord, help me to seek you through a life of daily prayer. In that life of prayer, draw me into a deep relationship with you, revealing to me all that you are and all that life is about. Jesus, I trust in you. Amen. Maraming salamat. Facebook friends, please subscribe to Facebook PH YouTube channel or download the Facebook app or visit and register at www.facebook.ph. Thank you and God bless all of you always.